Good afternoon. This old redneck, white-haired man here again with you. I just experienced something I ain't never seen before. Been raining here a lot lately. And I saw the mailman and three ducks riding in a canoe down my street delivering the mail. I ain't never seen nothing like that before in my life. It's just the way it is, you know. Um, had a few shipments today. Um, and we got a lot of stuff we're going to put on tonight. And been getting some good deals on shirts. And they had a 99 cent sale on that the other day. And we honored that uh, thrifting store I went to. Yeah, that's what it was. Uh -huh. And I didn't get but I think 38 Columbia's Columbia yeah I think I'm making maybe five six dollars off of them you know some total out all, all, off all of them you know? um, I, I, I'm gonna tell y'all a little story that I've learned I should have known for a long time but where are you garage sale and yard sale at to buy. It's got a lot to do with what you get at yard sales and the price for the most part. For example, boy that's a big word and I said it all by myself. Ain't y'all proud of me? I sure am. I sure am proud of me. I really am. But if you thrift, and I, this is nothing against anybody, but if you are selling garage sale in a low rent neighborhood, 99% of the time you're going to get low rent stuff. You might get cheap. It might be good. Most of it's going to be low rent because that's what the people have to buy because that's kind of money. Now, on the other hand, that would be on whichever other hand you want it to be, so it don't matter if it's on the other hand. You know. um, on the other hand, if you go to them garage sales, go to them yard sales, you know what I'm talking about? In them high rent neighborhoods, there's two things that usually happen, I've noticed. One thing, they got high dollar stuff for the most part. You know, they is rules to ever get over there. Well, what is a uh, Exceptions, exceptions. Boy, I am good today. It is exceptions. That means I'm exceptional brilliant. Well, we know better than that. Okay. So they have the, the good stuff there. And a lot of the times, they're, they've just outgrown it. They're children or whatever. They don't use it no more or whatever. And they ain't really worried about what they get for it. They just want it gone. You know, that makes a lot of sense. So I, I'm on I'm on check my theory out Friday morning and see how I come out on that deal. Saturday, if it ain't raining, you know, and uh, I, I say if the creek's right, if if the how won't put it. If the good Lord is willing and the creek don't rise. But I bet you that a lot of y'all don't know what that actually has to do with. I didn't know the other day and I'm 60 years old and I've heard it all my life and didn't know what the heck it meant. I do now. So, you know, if y'all want to find out, just ask me. I tell you. Heck yeah. I, I, I don't mind telling folks. Not at all. I, I you know, letting you know I'm not going to tell nobody nothing. You know, I don't believe it's just all that. You know, all that stuff. We have a lot of them uh, shirts we're going to be listing today. And uh, some of them can shoes. Shoot, I got a whole bunch of nice ones the other day. For, they were just real little, little, little priced. Little priced. I mean, like a dollar, two dollar pair for almost brand new Nikes and stuff. Hell, if I only make $10 a pair, I'm happy with that. You know, 
I'm, I'm happy with that. And every now and then you're going to run into one of them dollars that make you a big dollar. But you ain't going to find nothing if you don't get out of the bed and go looking for it. And they use people out there that makes a living uh, doing, uh, doing uh, what do you call it, uh, Craigslist only. A very smart person, yes he was. And, uh, but, you know, just think about that. It, it, it makes a little sense, uh, you know, some, just a little bit. Well, I'm going to put that theory, but, oh, well, back to Saturday, this coming Saturday. Uh, I'm going to that town called Bruton, Alabama. If it don't rain, it's going to be hot up there. They had that outside sale. People bring stuff there and sell it. Now I'm seeing time them people don't even know what it is they got. And I'm in the business not to tell them. And uh, I get some good deals up there. I, I've made some pretty good deals in farm auctions. Biggest turn of my life I ever made was at a farm auction. I turned three dollars into several, maybe several, several thousand, and that worked out real good for me. Yeah, and I like to do that again today, tomorrow, next day, and all that. Uh huh. Sure would. But um. I'm going to give y'all a shout out to uh, watch Wayne Hale's Mothership tonight. It comes on at that uh, 9 o'clock mountain time. Okay, so that means the big hand is going to be straight up and the little hand going to be pointing at the 9 if you live in the mountain time. Now if you don't live in the mountain time, if you live in like over here where we live in this uh, central time, and the little hand are going to be on the 8, and the big hand is going to be on the 12. See? And then the eastern, the little hand is 7, and big hand is 8. But if you live over yonder on the west coast, that changes things out tremendously. Then your little hand's got to be on the 10. I'm backwards, ain't I? I don't know. Hell, it's 9 o'clock mountain, whatever that is. I ain't very smart. I tried to tell y'all that already, but y'all ain't figured it out yet. Um, but I hope y'all have a good evening. and Y'all have y'all's uh, prayers and thoughts down yonder with them people in Louisiana because they fix to see this storm coming through there in Mississippi and everything. We got North Taters watches over here on us, you know. It rained in one minute and sunny one minute and dry one minute and hot as shit all the time. And that's pretty well, pretty much the way it is. Oh, I used that for that bad word again, hot. I need to quit this, using them bad words. Well, y'all have a good evening. I hope I didn't bore y'all too much with this, uh, Wednesday afternoon uh, BS section session 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 yeah, yeah. I gotta watch a baseball game night too it comes on at that uh, six o'clock on the uh, on the uh, yeah I know now what it is if it's nine o'clock mountain it will be eight o'clock somewhere else. I guarantee you that. I know it. It's like it's 420 somewhere, five o'clock somewhere, you know. Hell, I think it's 420 right now. That's what it says. 420. All right. Well, y'all have a great evening and remember this whole white-haired man here and watch my channel, Red Nickerson Three Sales. Like I told y'all before, I named this after my friend that lives in Brooklyn, Alabama. His first name was Red and his last name was Nickerson, so I named it after him. I hope I've done this man justice. I really do, you know. I know he had a lot of justice done to him when he was 
in his younger days. Yeah, that judge, justice. Yeah, that's, that's just the way it was. But, you know, time changed, people changed, you know. So, I'm going to go and let y'all go and uh, make sure y'all watch some mothership tonight. Me, oh, you, me, oh, you, me, a mothership, all right? I can't spell sometimes. That's just the way it is, okay? So, and Idaho Hillbilly, give me a shout sometime on that Facebook because I don't want to question for you. All right? And all y'all other ones have y'all a good time and. I hope you made it home safe, Golden Finger Picker Chad and Florida Picking, Picking Queen Kimberly and everybody else that went to that rally. I wish that I, wish that I could have went, but I wish that I didn't have enough money to go this time, but I go next time, you know, because I'd like to meet a bunch of y'all folks, you know. I don't know if y'all really want to meet me, but, you know, I, I like to meet y'all, you know. That, that would be a nice thing to do, you know. I think all y'all really neat folks, you know. you got to have a good attitude to be a reseller or you ain't going to be able to be a success in this business. Wow, I got that whole sentence out by myself. <laughs> all right, y'all have a good evening. We'll talk at you later. I sure will. Bye now.